I've just come back from Somaliland where I saw a terrible drought which is in danger of turning into a famine. I saw to my, for myself the people at the feeding stations, their dead animals and the devastation wrought by the drought. The UK government needs to do more to help to feed and make sure people have water and shelter. But in the long run, the UK government needs to help the Somaliland government and other governments in the region to make themselves more resilient to drought with boreholes, with dams, with irrigation schemes, with schemes to save rainwater. Because with climate change, we are going to see more and more of these droughts. It was my first visit to Hargeisa, and obviously we went to the feeding stations and we saw the people suffering. But I was also struck how dynamic a city Hargeisa is. And it would be a great shame if Somaliland, having made so much progress in recent years, was taken backwards by this drought and possibly a famine. They've done a lot, people are grateful, but first of all there needs to be more co coordination. Secondly, not just the UK government, but the UN need to move much faster. People are suffering, they cannot afford to wait for the bureaucratic process. And obviously we need to invest in making Somaliland and the rest of the region more resilient against these type of droughts. I think they have learnt to an extent, but I was dismayed in the slowness and the lack of coordination. We can stop what is a very bad drought turning into a famine, but everyone has to move faster and the resources must be made available.